Hey, it's your boy back with another Minecraft tutorial. Today, we're going to be doing a house tutorial. Now, you're probably wondering why should I listen to you for this house tutorial? I'm a four and a half time world champ Minecraft house builder. I also build a lot of houses and my buddies always ask me to build their houses. I'm so good at it. I'm just also just really good at building houses. So and in case you're wondering why you're going to need a house, there's pretty much three main reasons. Number one is you don't want to be homeless in Minecraft. If you're homeless in Minecraft, zombies are going to come and they're going to clap you, right? Like you're going to get clapped. Number two is if you want to get a Minecraft girlfriend or boyfriend, you're going to need a house because they don't want to date no homeless people. And number three, is you don't want to be poor. Not that there's anything wrong with being poor, you just don't want to be poor. So, without further ado, let's get right into the tutorial here. So, first, you're going to want to find a nice spot, preferably near a cow trapped in a fence. Now, it's hard to find them, so I just recommend capturing a cow and putting them in a fence yourself, like I did here. Now, exactly about three blocks from where the cow is in the fence, you're going to break that. That's going to be one of your floor holes right there. Now, I'd recommend placing a block in your floor hole. It can be any block for now. Next, you're going to want to select all the blocks you're going to want to use. You're going to need some wood for sure. I don't care what kind of wood you need. Just get some good wood. You're going to want some bricks. It doesn't really matter what bricks. I got bricks, the black ones. And then I got some white bricks too. I just like two bricks because I make it my house super fancy. You probably only want one because this is really confusing and you guys probably can't handle it. Then you're going to want a ladder, a door, some stairs, some fence, some fence gate, and some glass. Mm. Now, I just chose all this because it goes together so nice. But you guys probably won't get stuff that goes together nice since you're really bad at this. But I'm just super good. So you're going to want to take this, remember the floor hole right there, you filled it in. I used my white brick, and I'm going to go black brick. And I'm just going to make a pattern here, just like this. Normally I'd build like super big houses, it'd take me super long to make them. But I just really don't want to, because I'm, I just don't want to. I don't really have the time to try to explain this to you guys. So in the corner then, you're going to want to build up your wood. I usually like to go like like eight tall with my wood, like that. I don't, I don't know, I didn't even count it, but I, I just kind of, I just count my head automatically. So then with that wood, we bring it up super high, like eight. We just do that on all four corners. And then we're going to bring it together like this, see that? So this is the frame of our house right now, and it looks pretty good right now. And next we're going to need some stairs so you can actually get into our house. And I know there's a fence here, it doesn't really matter, just don't worry about that. And we're going to want to put some fence right here, just so you can get to the floor actually, you know. And then you're going to want more stairs to get over the fence. Right, and then you put the doors in, like right. You gotta, you gotta break one of them. You gotta put a block there, and then put your door in, right. And then you put in the walls. I usually go white on this side and black on this side. And then you're gonna want to put your glass in right here. I chose pink just because it goes so nicely with this. And it fits really well together with that door, as you can see. See, I don't, I don't like to go all the way up with it. So then I place black on the top. And this is actually where the ladders come in. You put ladders right here. That way that they're right there in case you ever need them. Like if you need ladders, you know where to go. With them. Now right here is where people run into trouble. So what I like to do is I place my stair like that, 
and I make it like a couch. So now you got a couch in here. And it also is kind of like a wall too. It's like a couch wall. If you know what I'm saying? And then we just build with this glass. And sometimes just to make it look fancy, I like throw a step in there or something. Good at it. And then this dirt, a lot of people would remove it. Don't. That's actually what won me one of the championships is I left the dirt in there. And like, you can even get tricky, throw a fence, right? No one sees that coming. They're like, why is there a fence in the wall? Art. And because if like someone's coming in your front door and like, you got to get out, you place the door right here and then you have a way out. But first you got to get your white block. Make sure it's the white one because the black blocks don't work for that door. It's just something I know. And then sometimes I put wood like that just to so I know there's a door right there. And finally, we got this wall right here. And for this wall, we're going to actually use a white brick, a black brick, white, white. You'll see this pattern. It's going to start to form really quick. A stair right there. I know you're thinking it'll make sense soon. And then obviously you need some windows to keep the light in. Nice and simple like this. Perfect. Now our house, the main part of it is complete. But... We're missing one step that everybody knows. You need this step. You need this bed for your Minecraft baddies. I usually like get two just in case because you need two people to sleep and you don't want people mm. sleeping in the same bed because that's not okay. And that right there, ladies and gentlemen, is why you want to, how you build your Minecraft house. Just remember the three reasons why. You get the Minecraft baddies so the zombies don't clap you because you don't want to be homeless. Okay?